Welcome to Animal Kingdom. Amazing fun fact about tarantula. Number 1. Tarantulas are part of the family of spiders called hairy megalomorphs. These are the spiders that scientists believe have been around for millions of years and have not changed much in that time. There are around 700 kinds, or species, of tarantulas. Tarantulas are found in the, rain in the rainforests and jungles of South and Central America, in Africa and in the southern part of North America. Many tarantulas live in burrows underground. They will either use their fangs to dig them or else take someone else's burrow home. Number 2 Even though they do not spin webs, tarantulas use their silk to make doors or soft walls for their burrow or, in the case of tree-living tarantulas, tunnel-shaped homes in trees. If a tarantula does feel threatened, it uses its hind legs to scrape barbed hairs from its abdomen and flings them in the direction of the, th of the threat. You'll know it if they hit you, too, because they cause a nasty, irritating rash. Some people may even suffer a serious allergic reaction as a result. The tarantula pays the price. 2. It winds up with a noticeable bald spot on its belly. Number 3 All tarantulas have an interesting way of defending themselves. They have hairs on their abdomen, stomachs, that have sharp little barbs, or pokey things, on them. When threatened, the spider will rub these hairs with their, with their legs and shoot them at their predator. That would hurt. Predators that the tarantula would be afraid of are weasels, hawks, owls, skunks and snakes. Their worst enemy is the spider wasp. The female wasp will paralyze the spider by stinging it. She then digs a hole and puts the spider and an egg into it. When the egg hatches, the baby wasp will eat away at the paralyzed spider. The spider could stay buried alive for many days before the larva hatch. Number 4 Tarantulas are rather thin-skinned creatures, particularly around the abdomen. Even a fall from a short height can cause a deadly rupture of the tarantula's exoskeleton. For this reason, handling a tarantula is never recommended. It's easy to get spooked, or even more likely, for the tarantula to get, to get spooked. Though most tarantulas tend to stay on the ground, they sometimes climb trees or other objects. By bending special claws at the end of each leg, the tarantula can get a better grasp of whatever surface it is attempting to scale. Number 5 During the warmest months of the year, sexually mature males begin their quest to find a mate. Most tarantula encounters occur during this period, when males disregard their own safety and wander during daylight hours. Should he find a burrowing female, he'll tap the ground with his legs, politely annou announcing his presence. Because tarantulas molt throughout their lives, replacing their exoskeletons as they grow, they have the ability to repair any damage they've sustained. Should a tarantula lose a leg, a new one will reappear as if by magic the next time it molts. Depending on the tarantula's age and the length of time before its next molt, the regenerated leg may not be quite as long as the one it lost. See you in other amazing and fun facts. Click like if you find it useful. Don't forget to subscribe for more.
keep good spirit.